Awesome. Um, welcome to our class today, guys. We are talking about company cam signatures. My name is Sarah. I'm an account manager here, and we have Bree and Jess and Sam and other marketing people uh, on this class with us today. So uh, we're going to do um, a full demo of everything, go through some pricing, how it works. And if you guys have questions, uh, please drop them in the question and answer box that's going to be located towards the bottom of your screen. Um, Jess and Bree will answer those for you, or we might even answer them live. So, um, again, please, the question and answer box would be great. Um, and let's go ahead and get started. So today's agenda, um, what are signatures? Uh, how you're going to use them, why you should use them, how you can get access to these signatures in your billing page. Uh, we have a little comparison sheet for you as well um, to compare the other big hitters out there that offer e-signatures. Um, and of course, again, your questions, and then we will finish the day with a demo of how the signatures works. Um, so to get started, uh, what are company camp signatures? Um, so our signature feature is an add-on to your already pro or premium company camp subscription, and it allows you to send documents for signatures right through your company camp dashboard. Um, so why, why should you use company cam signatures? Um, as you know, our mission statement is to allow you to see things in real time at your different job sites. So from photos to timeline links to reports to, to all of your projects, we want to give you that digital first communication. Um, and a big part of that process is sending out your contracts and your liability forms and your waivers and in all your estimates. Um, and so instead of doing that through a different software like DocuSign, uh, you can now do that in company cam. Um, you're able to upload a document, send it for signature, and receive that signature back in your documents tab. And the best part along the way is you, you know the status of it. Um, it'll say pending signature and receive signature, and you can do this through the app, your entire team knows. And, and everybody has access to it. Um, company cam signatures is for everybody on your team. Um, <clears throat> so how are you gonna get access to these signatures? Um, this is right through your billing page uh, and price, uh, the most important part, uh, $49 a month for the entire company. Um, so that is for unlimited users and unlimited signatures. So again, uh, you're paying uh, per user for your pro or your premium. Signatures is different. This is going to be a $49 flat fee for everybody. Um, and I will show you how to get to your billing page and everything uh, when we go through that demo. Um, so we have a quick little comparison sheet here of some other big hitters out there. Uh, Adobe Sign, DocuSign, um, very popular that you guys might be using. So the current workflow could be you're, you're sending these out through another software and then you have to download them and upload them into company cam. Um, again, through company cam, this will be all within the dashboard and it will live right there in the documents tab. Um, so with Adobe Sign here, their subscriptions, they vary a little bit, uh, about $24 a month per user um, for team. So again, ours is not per user, where a couple of these others, they, they are per user. Uh, DocuSign, again, it does vary on their different subscriptions, but up to $65 per user per month. Um, and again, some of these do make you sign up for three years, um, or there's a limited number of signature fields that you can drag and drop, you know, other little boundaries, I guess you could say, uh, where we really don't do that with our company cam signatures. Okay. Let's get started with the live demo of company cam signatures. Okay, so what you're looking at here, I'm guessing you guys can see my screen okay. Um, you're going to log into your company cam on the web, the website. So go to your browser, log into company cam, go ahead and go down to one of your projects. I am in my roof damage project here. Uh, next step is to navigate to your documents. Um, so if you're new to documents, you can upload these on the desktop side here through this add documents tab. You can also scan them in with your mobile device. So let's hit add document. Um, and this is actually new to company cam as of a couple days ago, uh, you can now uh, restrict access to people on company cam so they can't view all of your documents. So if you're on that standard or restricted level, um, you're able to restrict that here, um, where everyone can also see this. And so on that restricted only admins and managers could see this document. So just a quick hit there on that that is brand new to company cam. Um, this is where you would drag and drop that document into your project. 
I'm gonna go ahead and click on one. So my construction template here, um, here is my document. It's a couple pages. Move this over here. Um, this request signatures box will be up here in the top right corner. So go ahead and request signature. Um, you'll notice it says connecting to Dropbox sign. Um, so we actually um, are powered through them, a very reputable company formerly known as Hello Sign. So it makes it very easy for you to um, request these signatures. You might even be familiar with how it works. So step one is typing in the name and the email address. Um, this will be for the signer, so the customer. Um, you'll notice you can also add another signer. You can add multiple, um, really easy to do. We'll just stick with that one for now. Go ahead and click next. Um, up here, this is gonna be your status of where you're at and collecting these signatures. So step two is placing the fields. Um, so a few things to note. Um, first thing, top left corner, I'm on the signer part. So I'm gonna be dragging and dropping these fields for the customer or for that signer. Now you, um, as the company cam owner, um, the one who's sending this document, you can also fill out this document yourself, place text box, put your own signature in there as well. So what you do is just click on your name, it'll go down to me. And so now I can drag and drop these fields within my document as well. So I'm gonna scroll down, show you how you can go about that. Um, let's switch back to that signer. Let's do full name. So I'm just clicking on it and I'm dragging it over and I can drop it on the page. Let's do signature right there and let's do initials down here. Um, so you kind of get the feel for it, really easy to do. Click on it, drag and drop. Um, if you have multiple signers, these will also be color coded. Uh, makes it really easy for you to know what's going on within this document. Um, a few things on the right hand side. Uh, we have some styling things as far as um, the text or the font and the font size. Um, that will be over here. Uh, you can change that field name if you would like. You've got your full name up here. If you undo, redo, delete, you know, very, very basic things for you. Um, really easy to digest and figure out uh, when wanting to request these signatures. Um, so once you have it how you like it, you can click on your document here and kind of look at that print preview. It looks good. I've got my signature fields. I'm going to go ahead and click next. Uh, from here, um, you're able to send that email out. So uh, we've got the correct email address. Um, you can CC someone on this if you would like. You've got your subject line. Uh, I do recommend maybe putting the title of the contract in here, making it easy for the customer to know what is being sent to them. And then you can write them a message. So we're going to put please sign. Send for signature. And it's on its way. So now you'll see um, that little bar popped up. It said that the signature um, was sent and is out for request. And then the status bar in my company cam next to those documents will say a uh, pending signature um, and waiting for them to open it and complete it. And then of course the final step, it will be back in your documents tab. Okay, so went over to my email here and there's that email. Alrighty, um, it's got the name attached. So it has um, my work email where I sent it from, has requested signature. I will review and sign that. Uh, one thing I wanna note here that says it's not legally binding, uh, that's because it hasn't been signed yet. Um, so once you sign this document, it will in fact be legally binding and it will have that same bar at the top that will um, give you that announcement. So I'm gonna click OK, get started. And I've got my name, I already had that filled in. So they would type in their name, um, click to sign. So uh, this is in my save signatures. They will be able to draw that in. You can also type in your name as well, take a picture of it, or again, access your save documents or your save signatures that you have. Let's insert that and then click to initial. Let's use one of our saved ones here, or maybe we'll just, let's type it. That one looked pretty poor. <laughs> and we'll insert that right there. Um, everything looks good. We'll hit continue. 
um, here is that message about that I agree to be legally bound by this document through docu Dropbox sign. Good to go. I'll hit agree. And it was really that simple. Um, so now it will be coming back into your company cam. Um, and as a company cam user, you will get notified. Again, that status bar will change. Uh, you will get an email that says the customer has viewed your document and you will also get a notification via email that they have signed it. So you always know um, where it's at in the process and you know, can, can really manage your different documents within company cam. Um, and one other point here, as the signer, I also get an email saying, hey, here's your signed document, so I can keep it for record. All right, let's go back over here. Um, we'll see that it does say signed. Um, so that's great. We know where it's at. We have one down here that says signature pending. So that's what I mentioned earlier. Um, you always know the status of it, whether you're on mobile or you're on desktop. Are there any questions about company cam signatures? We have had a few people ask about templating. Oh, sure. OK, uh, great question. Um, so we do have templates coming to company cam very soon. Um, it will be in the future here. Now, as far as price point goes, that will look a little bit different. Um, so as far as things go with our templates here, we don't have that right now, and this is just through the desktop version. Um, but when templates come out in the future, um, you will be the first to know. We'll send an email about it, and we'll do probably another class. Um, but as of right now, you just need to ease, upload that document into your company cam project, um, and then you'll be able to send it out from there. That's, all we got. That's it? Okay, fantastic. All righty. So last part, um, I wanted to mention if you use a CRM with company cam and your documents are currently syncing over, um, these signed documents will be syncing over for you. So that's fantastic. I know Job Nimbus specifically, uh, we have our documents that sync over. So it um, would be really fantastic uh, to get both of those working for you. Um, and if you want to get started with it, which I highly recommend, again, it's just the $49. It's month to month. Um, in the future here, we, we might have an annual option, but uh, there's no sign-up costs, no cancellation fees. You can try it out, uh, again, for $49 a month for the entire team, uh, just by going to your billing page. Uh, really easy to do. You just click on your profile picture up here, go down to your billing, and right here it will say add signatures. You can click that, get started with it right away. Um, you'll have access, access instantly, and you'll see that first um, bill come through. And again, if you have any questions about getting signed up with it, if, if you're not able to access your billing for some reason, um, or have more questions, we have an entire customer success team that would love to help you with that. Um, Bree, if you can drop that in the chat, it's success at companycam.com. Uh, we'd be happy to reach out. Uh, do another demo with you, talk with you on the phone, um, and get you set up with company cam signatures. Let's see. Um, so to wrap that up, uh, we've got a few fun, exciting things coming to company cam. So Blueprint um, is our event that we host uh, in May, uh, formerly known as Highway to Hail. Um, so it is Blueprint moving forward. And we're going to be in Dallas, Denver, and Chicago um, on May 3rd, May 17th, and May 31st. And we have a really cool um, keynote speaker. His name is Sean Van Dyke. And so he will be there. Um, and everything you need to know about the trades and um, covering tech and your team and traction. So it's always a good time. You'll get a lot of value out of it. Um, I will be in Dallas. I know Bree's also going to Dallas. And so the customer success team will be there where we can talk to you um, about your account and set up integrations, do demos, you know, whatever it might be. So um, if you'd like to get registered, um, that's located at the bottom of the screen. We'll also drop it in the chat. Um, companycam.com slash blueprint is where you can get registered for that. Um, and it will it will be a great time. So um, again, wanted to thank you all for joining us. Uh, there, we will be sending this out as a recording. Uh, it will be in your inbox along with that comparison sheet. Um, I know there was a lot to digest on that as far as Adobe Sign, DocuSign, things like that. Um, we can also link that in there or if it was in the chat, just go ahead and take a look at that as well. Um, but again, 
go ahead and get signed up for company cam signatures and um, we'll catch you next time. Okay, we're back. Uh, we have a couple questions. I forgot to ask my team members here. Um, so what questions, Jess? Yeah, so we do have quite a few people who were curious about if they're able to sign on mobile. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Um, so you are able to um, receive that document via email and sign it through your mobile device, yes. Um, you're not able to send that document through the mobile app as of right now. That is coming very soon, I believe, Q2, is that right? Yeah, Q2. Um, so be able to send it through mobile if you're receiving that as the customer yeah open that email sign it you're good to go yeah absolutely okay so uploading a document um, we're going to go back to that project click in there and you've got your documents tab you'll see i have 11 loaded in here already um, again, this is going to be on the desktop side. You can just click Add Document, um, and if you click here, it's going to take you to you know your your downloads and everything. Oop, I'm getting an in call, an incoming call. I'm going to hit Cancel. So that's what you would click. You can also drag and drop them in there, and then they will upload into Company Cam on the mobile device. Under Documents, you have the option to upload or even scan in. So you can hold it over, scan it in, and it will save. And Sarah, would you? my brain through the pricing just one more time yeah, for everybody. Absolutely. So so pricing with company cam signatures. Um, it's a $49 flat fee per month. Um, and that's going to be for the entire company. So this isn't user to user. This is $49 flat um, per company um, month to month. And again, you can try it out. Don't like it, drop it. There's no sign up fees, no cancellation fees. It's a month to month subscription. And that's in addition to your subscription. Yep, yep. And this is going to be in addition to your already pro or premium subscription that you have. Um, and you can just go to that billing, click add on, and it will be you've got your pro and then you'll have your company cam signatures. On top of that is how those two subscriptions will work. Now, if you decide you don't want to keep continuing with signatures, again, we can cancel that it is by the month and you can still keep your pro or premium subscription with company cam. Ooh, edit and resend a document. Great question. Um, so I recommend hitting that back button. So let's go ahead and click in here to that document. Request signature. I'll just show you how this works really quick. Alrighty, so as you're placing these fields, um, we'll just drag a few in here. Um, if I would hit next, um, I am able to hit this back button. So I can go back and continue to edit this document with the different fields that I'm placing. Now, if this is a document that you uploaded and you need to adjust that original document, um, you'll need to do that through, you know, how you ever created the document in the first place. But if it comes to dragging these fields, um, and we do have that text box that you can fill out and write quite a bit of text, um, hit that back button and you'll be able to edit that. Good with questions? Okay, all right. Thanks again, guys. Um, really appreciate you joining with us and hope you sign up for signatures.